Nellie Mae Rowe was born on July 4, 1900, in Fayette County, Georgia. She was an artist most known for her multicolored works on paper, hand-sewn dolls, and her home art installations. Her work focused on African-American folklore, race, gender, and spiritual traditions. Rowe's home and yard served as her first canvas, and she transformed it using dozens of objects from dolls and stuffed animals to recycled household materials. She was able to recast discarded materials into art. Her work desired to recreate scenes from her daily life, memories, and dreams through an imaginative practice of color, space, and form. Her sculptures take the form of bus-like figures made out of old stockings or hardened chewing gum with elaborate outfits and yarn wigs and glasses. While her early works focused on a single subject, later works exhibit more complicated compositions. She altered photographs to create sympathetic portraits of close friends and family. During the final years of her life, Rowe's artistic career pinnacled in nationwide attention and substantial financial success. Rowe is now recognized as one of the most important American folk artists. Her work is held in numerous collections, including the Metropolitan Museum of Art, the Museum of Fine Arts Houston, the Schomburg Center for Research in Black Culture in New York City, and the Studio Museum of Harlem. Nellie Mae Rowe died on October 18, 1982, at the age of 82.